Hello, my name is Shahira and I'm from Malaysia. I'm a space artist, a dark sky advocate, and an educator. So today I'll be talking about my abstract, which is entitled Interpreting and Popularizing Astronomy to the Public Through Arts in Social Media. Intersection of Astronomy and Arts. Astronomy is an intensely visual subject. Before photography, the only way to represent the phenomenon in night sky is through painting and drawing. Some architectures in the past are designed to reflect the celestial movements. Artists and astronomers from back then until today work together to see, record, and simulate the events in the night sky and in the universe, and this in return stimulated questions about our place in the universe. So this is one of the painting that shows intersection between astronomy and arts entitled The Great Comet of 1680 over Rotterdam by Le Vichuet. And of course, Sidereus Nietzsche's by Galileo Galilei, where he recorded his observation through his telescope by drawing. And this one is the Gosset Circle in Germany, which is actually an ancient solar observatory uh, where the entrances orientated according to the setting and rising of solstices. Social media, the existence of social media expands our world virtually, enable us to connect with others across the globe. For example, Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, and so on, provide a wider platform to share news and information. And during the pandemic outbreak, a lot of astronomical programs, even events, are shared through social media. Humanity has been keeping in touch with each other through social media during this pandemic more than ever. So what can we achieve by popularizing astronomy through arts and social media? What will happen if these three elements intersect? First, we are able to instill passion in astronomy to the public by incorporating science in the works of arts. And how do I do that? Based on my experience uh, in expressing passion through arts, by being a space artist, I create arts based on personal knowledge and readings on astronomy subject. Whatever that interests me, I try to work on it artistically. I approach my audience through social media and get to know their subject of interest in astronomy. I create arts that trigger questions to the observer by combining abstract and realism. I also explore different style of making arts by referring to different artists and currently I'm working on Van Gogh's style of expressing the night sky. I also make sure that my arts have scientific and artistic explanation based on the style and colors of the astronomical subjects I'm working on. So these are among of my space arts that I have uh, made and this is one of my favorite, which is the artistic interpretation of Ro Ofushi complex clouds, where I express the movement, the lights, and the colors of the Ro Ofushi by using tendrils and bright colors. This is the artistic interpretation of Sagittarius A at the center of the Milky Way. So the explosive part in the painting is actually where the black hole resides. And the effect of the black hole can be seen uh, by looking at the movement of the gas clouds, which I express here by using tendril style. And even though you cannot see the black hole due to the interstellar extinction, you can still see the effect that caused by the black hole uh, by the surrounding gases. And this one is a colliding antenna galaxies where I experimented with fluorescent paint which give me the glowing effect when I cast UV light in the darkness. So next is we are able to reach out to the public through social media by organizing interesting online events related to astronomy. So becoming an active member in local and international astronomy or science community is a great way to reach out. 
For example, I interact with local astronomy communities in Malaysia and involve myself with the programs organized. And that same goes with the international science and art community as well. I approach to the public with unique way of expressing passion in astronomy and in my case is through visual arts. And some people who are passionate in astronomy, they approach the public through astrophotography, um, composing astronomy music, and even producing films. Some astronomy, um, I also attract the public to participate in astronomy events or programs by making eye-catching posters and videos, um, which I am working on with Dark Sky Malaysia, a dark sky and light pollution advocate. So that's what I did to attract the public's attention is by making teaser videos, posters, interesting posters um, based on the astronomical events. Because imagery is essential in attracting public attention, especially through social media. And making tutorials, social media takeover, and online events is also a great way to reach out to the public to be interested in astronomy, because those are among the ways that we can do in social media to convey knowledge. And it is important to collaborate with science and, and astronomical associations in organizing events to reach bigger audiences. So this is one of the, this is among the events that I have um, conducted. This one is with Science Art Party, the IG Takeover, which I made a live painting and interact with the audience. And this is um, from STEM, STEM Cox IG, Canvas to Cosmos, which I also did live painting. This is with CosmoQuest. I talk about a scientific explanation behind my space art. And this is with the local Malaysian local art club, which I talk about light pollution and dark sky awareness through arts. This is with Dark Sky Malaysia. I talk about myself as a space artist. And this is with the local universities where I talk about astronomy for everyone. For those who are not from STEM background, they are also able to pursue their passion in astronomy. And this is during the National Science Week in Malaysia where I did a live painting and interact with the audience questions and explaining about my process in making space arts. Okay. Next is to connect the public with astronomy intellectually and emotionally through arts in social media. So when creating arts related to astronomy or science subject, it is important to provide detailed and thoughtful explanation of the subject. Sharing the process of producing artworks is a good way to connect um, with the audiences and to show them that artworks start and progress with experiments and mistakes. This way, they will feel closer to the artist and as well as the artwork. To relate artwork with others, it is important to convey my emotions when I'm working on the subject. I tell my audience how does working on the subject makes me feel. In conjunction of creating arts, I also sometimes write poems related to the artworks and I enjoy connecting human emotions or events with astronomy. And last but not least is to be expressive and transparent about your feelings. Don't force it out. And it is important to work on subject that you love. So this is one of the artwork that I have worked on, which is entitled Light Above Us. I included poems and detailed explanation about this artwork. And this one entitled Losing Touch, which is a three canvas painting combined into one. And I also included poems and the importance of protecting our night sky from light pollution. That's all from me. Thank you very much.